we started uh, waving to see how they would react and a lot of the crew members waved back in a quite friendly way but the officers as usual were giving giving them hell for doing that so we just did like we did last year we swung right in front of the harpoon and stayed there and they were obviously still searching swinging the harpoon one way or another and the whales blew a couple of times but they were still at the early stages of the hunt when the whales could sound quite a while now last year it took about an hour for the whole thing to ha happen but ending with them shooting the harpoon but this time they swiveled the cannon around and and then finally uh, they just I guess they got an order from somewhere and they uh, stopped um, slam clicked the harpoon up and put the pins in and uh, shut her down and uh, they've been sitting here ever since they tried to start up again a couple of times and, uh, and then we got back in front of them and they stopped again so uh, they're stopped at the moment we'll see what happens from here by this time I heard the two zodiacs had arrived so we had an odd uh, floating picket line in the in the middle of the Pacific Ocean with a Russian chaser boat, whale killing boat, stopped dead in his tracks. And uh, after about an hour of this, uh, they even put the uh, canvas bag back over the harpoon. And it was obviously that they decided not to shoot at us or over us this time and so we have stopped one chaser boat already and saved one pot of whales which is not bad for our first morning's work we stopped them once and that means we have the capability of, of stopping them more and more over Hello, friends. Excuse me, but please stop killing the whales. Stop killing the whales. It is discovered that some of the crew aboard the Vostok speak English. Today we thank you for sparing our lives. That was a humane gesture. It showed respect for human life. Now, however, we must begin to have respect for other life, for Comrade Dolphin and Comrade Whale, because without them, the oceans begin to die. And if the oceans begin to die, we all begin to die. We've seen the ocean ourselves. There are not many whales left. These whales belong to all the people of the earth. We are asking that you stop for the benefit of your children and grandchildren as well as ours. We feel no anger towards you. We view you as our brothers and sisters on planet earth. But we are trying to speak for the earth. We respect your nation, your revolution and your history. And now we're asking you, from your position of strength and power, to grant us a small request. Please stop killing the whales. We are men and women, and we speak for children, and we're all saying, please stop killing the whales. Yet, despite the efforts of Greenpeace, the slaughter of whales continued. The strategy of non-violent confrontation carried out by a single vessel, no matter how effective, has obvious physical limitations in protecting all the whales in all the oceans of the world. We kept up our harassment over a distance of 1,700 miles. Each time contact was made, the whalers responded by shutting down their operation. They would not leave dead whales floating in the water, and they would not kill whales in front of our cameras. So the camera proved to be mightier than the harpoon. The fleet finally attempted to evade us, but we stayed right with them, keeping up the pressure as long as we could. The Vostok and its nine killer boats were forced to steam far faster and further than usual, making their entire whale killing operation less efficient and costing them dearly in additional fuel consumption. The final score, 
100 whales saved by direct confrontation, 1,300 other whales protected from the threat of being slaughtered off the coast of North America, and a Soviet fleet forced to waste time and money trying to evade Greenpeace. Holiness of morning, I love you through sad eyes. Though you be a perfect ending for the darkened skies. Cloud formations move to prove there is no form that stays. Mankind weaves a wayward path, ignoring nature's ways. Oh, we are but the lightning, we're a glimpse of what is wise. In the ocean's holy foam, the whale to breathe must rise. Land all laced with poison is choking on the load. Mankind murders all his friends, he's soon to be alone. Nature wove together an intricate design We have since unraveled it in all too brief a time Killing wolves and eagles for living as they must It's on and on till balance fails as species bite the dust my mind I see no rhyme or reason to this maze and in my heart I feel we are but slaves in many ways the animals that were our friends before we taught them fear haven't they a proper right to keep on living here the epic of the endless seas is drawing to a close Corporation, factory ships, deal the final blow Pledging falsely that their plunder serves the people's needs While the bleeding oceans flow, a monument to greed Oh, if by chance they ask you for approval of this mess Dear friends, tell them where you stand and do your level best To aid the cause for needed laws protecting all you see Let's help to stop the senseless killing on the land and sea Pray to God it's not too late to set the dolphin free Pray to God it's not too late to set the dolphin free